Hello. I haven't put out a canning video in a while. I'm going to show you what I'm doing today. I've got these two packages of ground pork. I've got some more that I'm going to use for something else. But this is equal to about five pounds of ground pork. Found it on sale, so I decided to get some. So, today, I'm going to mix up sausage. Now, we've used this before. It's really, really good. And it calls for five pounds of meat. So what I'll be doing is mixing it up in this bowl. Using gloves. And then I'll store it overnight to let those flavors really get through all this pork. I'll bring you back so I've got it mixed up and ready to store. Sorry about that. Okay, you can see it on the meat. And just use gloved hands. Mix it around kind of like you do with a meatloaf. Get it in there really good. I'm not going to film canning sausage because I've done that before. And I will give you a link to that video. Uh, but this will... My gloves want to work off. This will give you an idea how you can take fresh ground pork and turn it into your own delicious homemade sausage. Now we did this with our pigs we killed too. And I just uh, browned it all up, scrambled it up. And canned it like that to use on in omelets or on pizza uh, as gravy, sausage gravy. But uh, it's pretty easy. You can get if you if you can get the ground pork. You can use that. See my gloves trying to come off. You can use ground pork or get if you've got a butcher. Have him uh, just get take a boneless pork loin and let him grind it up, fat and all, and then uh, then you'll have ground pork that you can use. I like this better than any of the commercial sausage we bought in the past, and even the really expensive brands. This is a really good mix. It's Mrs. Wages, perfectly seasoned. And uh, we love it. So, there you go. I'll bring you back when I really am through mixing it. Okay, I cheated a little bit and added about a tablespoon of crushed red pepper to this. Yeah, yeah. We like hot food. Whenever I make pickles, I always add hot pepper to the pickles too, unless I'm going to give them away. So, there you are. There it is all mixed up. I'll put it out here in the cooler on ice, and by tomorrow, the, all these seasonings will be all through here, soaked in real good, and it'll be ready to can. Thanks for watching.